Well, I guess door. Both. Um. Yeah. <coughs> so, interesting thing. I was watching a um, Let's Play of Resident Evil 2 from uh, one uh, YouTuber named Necroscope. And he had his scenario start off with uh, uh, Claire first. Uh, interesting thing that I found out is that um, under like some kind of certain circumstances at the very beginning, uh, you can actually run into a zombified form of the stars member Brad. Oh, Sherry. Claire. Okay, to be continued. Sherry, you're okay. I'm glad to see you're safe, Claire. Can I talk to you? Okay, so I'm just gonna go over here. But uh, yeah, you just you meet up with a, a zombified form of uh, Brad, which is the helicopter pilot from the first game. So, and apparently, if you kill him, you get some kind of special key, and you actually get a new handgun, which just happens to be a Colt's uh, Peacemaker. Which was cool, but I don't know if I can be able to get it. Because from what I, uh... Because what I heard from Neko apparently, is actually very hard to kill. Hello. What have we here? Dramatic turn to the right, and all of a sudden there's something right there waiting for me. Mail to the chief. To Mr. Brian Irons, chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative, Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effect upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members, Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and Vickers. If it comes to light that the stars have any evidence as to the re activities of our research, dispose of them in such a manner that would appear to be purely accidental. Continue to monitor progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact throughout this affair. Annette. Wayne Birkin. Wait, was that the crazy chick who tried to kill us in, Leon, in Leon's, uh... Is, is that Annette Birkin? Is that his wife, apparently? To Mr. Brian Irons, I have deposited the amount of $10,000 to the account for your services in this term as per our agreement. The development of the G-Virus schedule to replace the T-Virus is near completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the executive board for Umbrella Inc. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. Redfield and remaining STARS members are still attempting to uncover information about the project. Continue to monitor their activities and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facilities. William Birkin. We have a problem. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G-Virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the, uh, search the city thoroughly for any suspic suspicious persons. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary and contact me immediately through a net. With these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus. Not even Umbrella. <coughs> And what the hell is this? An elevator? That's an elevator, isn't it? I've got a bad feeling about this. Alright, what happens if we go back to, uh, Sherry? Can I take her with me? Kinda didn't want to leave you in this weird, creepy place. Which just happened to be missing a dead body. But okay. It appears to go down. Ah, there we go. Claire! 
I'm going down there. Stay here and wait for me, okay? Why do I get the feeling that's probably a bad idea? Who's to say that Mr. Crazy Irons will come back? Anyways. Where the hell am I? Police station basement. Oh, I got a bad feeling about this. I was about to turn in some like weird Fifty Shades of Grey nonsense. This looks like a dungeon. This is straight up a dungeon, not a basement. Those are shackles. This is a dungeon. This is a dungeon. This is totally a dungeon. This had better not be a sex dungeon. Oh, this is about to go Fifty Shades of Grey, isn't it? <laughs> so you've made it this far. Not bad, girl. I'm not letting anyone leave my town. Everyone's gonna die. Calm down, Chief. What happened? Hmm, that's a nice sight. Shut up! You couldn't possibly understand what's happened. Those monsters from Umbrella have destroyed my beautiful town. Is that a desert eagle? How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? So it's true. You have been working with Umbrella. Then you must know about the G-Virus. What is it? Tell me! If you must know, it's the agent that can turn humans into the ultimate bio-weapons. Superior to the T-Virus in every way. Dr. William Birkin is the genius behind the project. William Birkin? I'm sure you've already seen his little girl running around here somewhere. Sharing, isn't it? In case you haven't already figured it out, the monster that's been tearing my precinct apart is yet another product of the G-Virus. An ultimate bio weapon. Umbrella must be trying to cover its tracks. But if I have to go, I'm going to take you with me. How about no? Oh, uh, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> he's like, uh, hmm. Uh, yeah, he's totally dead, but I'm just gonna take a look at what the fuck is all of this? Formalin, chloroform, and other chemicals? Is this as taxed as a saw? And it's bloody, and it's got scratches on the table. Is this his taxidermy little hobby shop down here? Nope, I didn't pee myself. Because I went before I uh, started. Just like anybody with a brain knows how to go, uh, what to do before you go on a road trip. Who what's this? Yes. How can I not say no to that? Disturbing stuff. <laughs> Apparently. As if the uh, ripped torso right here isn't disturbing enough. Ugh. 
I'm just getting like big old evil dead vibe right now. We're gonna get you. Oh, what the hell is this? Is that broken? Looks like it could be. Yep, that's him. Just slowly back away. Oh, he's mutating. Here, have some arrows. Okay. Oh! Ow! 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 Get up! Claire! Get up! Run! No time for- What?! Oh, frick nuggets. Oh, frick nuggets. Okay. Nope. You missed! You missed! Claire! Well then, he just completely wrecked me. Resident Evil. Now I gotta go through all that crap again? <laughs> Sorry, Claire. How about we backtrack and get you that grenade launcher before we go down that uh, creepy hole? How about that? Yeah? Yeah? No, actually, uh, how about this? Uh, where is it? Oh, I have film. I haven't got... Uh, how can I have film? Okay, I think we're good now this time. Okay, Claire. You good? Let's try that dance again. Claire! Sherry, you're okay. I'm glad to see you're safe, Claire. And then this. This. Not even 30 minutes, I already killed Claire. Wait, was that the fur? I don't remember. Is that the first time I actually killed Claire? Claire! I'm going down there. Stay here and wait for me, okay?
Well, at least we know it's not a sex dungeon. <laughs> so, you've made it this far. Not bad, girl. But I'm not letting anyone leave my town. Everyone's gonna die. Calm down, Chief. What happened? Shut up! You couldn't possibly understand what's happened. Those monsters from Umbrella have destroyed my beautiful town. How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? So it's true. You have been working with Umbrella. Then you must know about the G-Virus. What is it? Tell me! What's the design on the it back of her jacket or vest? It's the agent that can It's too blurry, I can't really make the it out. Ultimate bio weapons. Superior to the T virus in every way. Dr. William Birkin is the genius behind the project. William Birkin? I'm sure you've already seen his little girl running around here somewhere. Sherry, isn't it? In case you haven't already figured it out. Excuse me. The monster that's been tearing my precinct apart is yet another product of the G-Virus. An ultimate bio-weapon. Umbrella must be trying to cover its tracks. But if I have to go, I'm going to take you with me. Made in heaven. Hmm. Like, um, oh my. Ooh. Um. Okay. And then. Alright then, oh wait, hold on. Um, acid rounds. Eat grenade! Why'd the music stop? <laughs> 